Hi there, here's Tati from Mangios. Today I would like to explain the advanced tiles in Emeos backend. Most of the advanced tiles are hidden by default and will be shown when you click on the arrow symbol. The quantity scale is the step value allowed for quantities in a basket. This can be fractional quantities like 0.1. But this wouldn't work well for this product, because you can't sell one-tenth of the bike. If you enter two, then customers can buy the multiple of two, so two, four, or six bikes. Switch to the front ends, and in the details page, you can choose three, for example. You can also enter a start and an end date. This is useful for seasonal articles, like Christmas products, for example. If you enter a start date, then the article won't be shown before that time. And choosing an end date won't show it after that time anymore. If I enter this start date, and this end date, Then the bike is only shown during December of 2020. In the created field, you can set the creation date of the product, which is used for sorting in the front end. If I enter this date as created date, Then you can see that the product switches into the last place if you sort by latest. The URL target is the root name or page ID of an alternative, alternative product detail page. This field is only for experts, so leave this empty to avoid errors in the front end. In the option table, you can add any key value pair, e.g. you can specify CSS classes. So you can assign badges to products in the front end, like uh, new or sale. And you can see the new CSS class in the source code. Switch to the Media tab. Here you can also add the start and end date for images, like for products in the Basic tab. Same is possible for texts and for prices. This means that the items will only be available between the start and end date. And you can use it for seasonal images, texts and prices, e.g. for Christmas or sales. I will first add a new and lower price. And I'll set the start date for yesterday and the end date for tomorrow. Now you can see that the price in the front end has changed. So if two prices exist at the same time, so the periods overlap, then the lower price is taken. Now go back to the Media tab. In the Media Properties, you can add media titles for different languages. Move on to the text tab. Here you can add the basket description. This means that this text will be shown additionally in a basket. In our example, green color.
Now put the bike in a basket and here you can see the basket description. In the categories tab, there's the option to add promotion products. These are displayed above the list of normal products. I will add our bike. You can see it in the front end if you select categories and home. The bike is marked as a top seller now. Ta-da! Thanks for watching. See you. You're Tati from Mamios.